What up, YouTube? I'm back. Basically, you see my people in the back right there, right there. Trying to get the camera set up right. Sometimes it takes a little thing. I'm feeling really good today. I just want to give a shout out to uh, YouTube crew. I want to give a shout out to you, everybody that's watching. Uh, for Red Hook. Uh, basically, that's the project that I rep. Brooklyn, New York. Uh, Brooklyn, Illinois, Florida, uh, Virginia. But today I want to do a little poetry. I want to give a shout out to all those that is uh, detained, uh, locked up in prison, uh, those who have lost their mind, those who have, are tired, those who thought they knew uh, the right way to go and for whatever reason they made a wrong turn. Uh, basically, uh, with time and patience, everybody can be healed. I don't believe in the word hell. I think they mispronounced it with the vowels and the syllable. Syllables is to be sly and able. And I believe that when they say hell, they're, they're trying to just keep you uh, in their midst, keep you uh, frightened and is uh, healed because I know that uh, basically that um, my further, who you call father, which is actually not a body but a force, um, it's not, it's a healing process. It's not a helling process. You know, the, uh, the word hell is only H-E and L-L, which means he's ill. And actually that has to do with man because he comes from the womb of another man and basically he, he took a, he took over authority for now, not knowing that uh, I was coming back and the crew was coming back. We we're actually called Elohim. Uh, our color is green, uh, money green at that. They actually used our colors and put it on a rectangle to wreck uh, your uh, world, as they say. And, um, but I wanted to do a little poetry. You know, I just want to give a shout out to everybody that's came before me and uh, provided this uh, this wonderful uh, place and uh, basically people cannot see it because it's too materialistic you know uh, it all started off with um, protecting the women and then it got to the point of people forgot translations greed uh, a lot of other things but now women must step up. Um, I know a lot of you are afraid of being the rulers and the leaders, and um, you do have some sisters in every denomination in the circle, or in every demonstration of the circle uh, to help you and to guide you. And we're all, there's nobody going before the next. But only my crew is basically Taking a circle and um, taking a circle, and um, basically, we at that point, one point in the circle, and we extend ourselves into the circle and out of the circle, and that's where you get the figure Q from uh, for quiet, you know. But um, basically, uh, that's what's going on with that. Uh, come here when it's just somebody. He's gonna stick his head and say, what's up? Say, what's up? Yeah, his name is L-O-R-D, and basically, uh, you figure the rest out, you know what I'm saying? And um, he just came in from school, so he's getting his, as he's getting his review, actually, because uh, he already been taught, you know? Okay, studies are habit, it's a good habit. Okay, so basically what I want to do is give you a, a, a little bit of poetry. And the first one is called uh, A Court of Attitude. And it was based on, um, see poetry and uh, rap is different. Poetry is like, after poetry they say, well why did he say this? And what, what position did he have? Did he have money in his pocket? Uh, where was he located? Oh, uh, was he happy? Was he in love? You know, they put a lot of variables behind poetry. So, 
what so you won't have to think about it you can always you know say what you want to say but basically what happened was when I got here in the year uh, it's this debate about when I got here when I got here when I realized when I was here when I got here when I started it don't really make no difference uh, that's a tank uh, 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 is a is a thought is it basically what they call a blinking of the eye but basically when I got here and I started looking around the first thing that I could remember I was watching TV and they said the word D-I-C-K and it flipped me out where I'm like what are they talking about and it was actually Dick Clark and I was like uh, I asked my brother I said well are, are they saying that and he was like, yeah, what's, the, what's wrong with you? And that's when I knew that um, basically I had a dual spirit. And so it took a while to adjust, you know. I had to go into deep meditation and crying and, and all kind of stuff. So people was like, what is wrong with this guy, you know? But um, you had other people who actually, I guess they was trying to uh, help me out. So they took... What I, what I had, which was a 30-year plan, and they actually put it on and they started using it. And um, a lot of people now is up to the point where the 30-year plan is gone. And so now I must come out and say what I have to say, but like they gave me a little bit of rest. But they know that they couldn't do my job. So um, the poem that I'm gonna, that I'm going to say to you it was basically uh, the, the way I felt about what was going on in the world. And I'm going to get you that uh, right after this.